The last thing I remember is actually being wheeled into ED. I spent that two weeks in ICU, um, I think 10 days in a coma. Um, and then the next thing I knew I'd woke up and the Commonwealth Games were over. Princess had had a baby. <laughs> Doctor. He called a family meeting in yeah. relation yeah. to Kim and at that particular point he sat everyone down and he said that it was his belief that she wouldn't survive. He said, I don't like using the word miracle but we need it and um, we're very grateful yeah. to see we've got that miracle. From what the family have said, they still were told that this could be the rise before the fall because um, I wasn't expected to live. So they weren't getting their hopes up too much, but yeah, in my head there's no way I was dying. <laughs> so I think I was 45 kilos when I left the hospital. I had found out once I got out of the coma that had no idea about sepsis, didn't even know it existed. Um, I've since learnt a lot about it and how it works and how it's 100% preventable. I think with awareness um, and with more training, people will be aware, they will know and they will look for the signs because you need to be get to ED straight away and ask yourself, could this be sepsis? Um, you know, because it quite possibly can. And it was in my case and I would never have thought that in a million years. So I know you might get 50,000 people in a day with backache, but I'm that one who nearly died. And yeah, listen to the family. Um, no one should go from being this vibrant life to fighting for their life. Yeah. My name is John Dick and I'm an acute care physician at the hospital. Today is World Sepsis Day, which is aimed at the public um, and is aimed at raising awareness. Sepsis is when infection starts to overwhelm the body's ability to deal with it. So the signs and symptoms are the usual signs of infection, so fevering, chills and temperature. Um, but then you start to get additional symptoms. Um, blue or mottled fingers or extremities. Um, feeling of impending doom, which sounds silly, but it's, it's true. Blood pressure lowers, so you feel very faint, can't stand up properly, um, and you may well start to get confused as well. Within uh, the profession itself is very much aimed at um, the treatment pathway that you follow once you've recognised it. The early recognition is, is the key, because we talk about a golden hour, the sepsis six hour. Because if you get to us, we can get to you.